trying to see if I could get away without taking a shower today, but there was just no way. There was just no way I could get away without taking a shower. I, I, I tried. Because I was, I wanted to, so, I actually, I've got a nightmare of a, of a travel, just, just nightmare of traveling today. It was just, I mean, not, not even just today, just, I mean, just there and back. Well, actually, there was okay. You've gotten away with it for years, what do you mean? What do you mean, what do you mean? Sorry, I mean, like, you, I, that's not true. We've debunked it. Remember, we debunked it. We debunked that I do sh it's the washing hair and so I washed my hair today as you can tell it looks clean It smells clean. You can't smell it But if you could one day there's gonna be something where you will like smell the things in my room So you really like You know you'll like really feel like if I light a candle You can like turn on a button and it's actually I don't really think you want this <laughs> That sounds terrible there, There's some people's rooms my room smells great well, I think it smells great, but I the re okay. I actually think my room doesn't actually smell that great. The reason I think so, I think it smells good. Right now, I smell nothing. But every time I come back into my room, like after I've like gotten used to other smells, I come into my room. I'm like, it smells kind of funky in here. And then I enter it, and then five minutes later, it doesn't smell funky anymore. I think it's just having cats. And what you gonna do? I've got two litter boxes in there. Shrug. I mean, it is what it is. I clean them out and it still smells funky. I add that bacon stuff too. that the bacon powder Not 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 bacon, <laughs> but like baking powder. I add that stuff to it and it still smells funky. So Shrug what you gonna do? All right. Um Why are you admitting to that ma'am? <laughs> All right some coffee. Listen, I'm sleep deprived. My mom keeps me up when I go home my mom it, it's it's it might be a form of torture <laughs> uh, What my mom does to me and I don't know it's bad it she keeps me up With the most tedious tasks Can you imagine like think about how much you guys know of me and then how much I would hate this Okay, my mom keeps me up as I'm just yawning. I'm so tired. She has me matching a receipt from like May of 2022 some unknown company She's like, Leslie, right here, do you see this receipt? There's a charge for $800, $830 from this company. What did you do? Where is it from? Do you have the receipt? And I'm like, <sighs> no, I don't have the receipt, mom. She's like, well, we got to find it. Okay, call the, call the bank. I'm like, you want me to call the bank? She said, call the bank. I'm on the phone with the bank. Okay, and I'm like, hi, hi there. And they're like, yeah, state your name. Yeah, hello, yes, so, um, Merry Christmas. Uh, so I've got a question. In May of 2022, there's a charge. I just want to know what company it's from. You know, it's got this name. And they're like, all right. And my mom goes, oh, by the way, I'm here too. Hello. And the bank is like, oh, uh, who's that? And I was like, oh, that's my mom. And they're like, oh, well, we need to get verbal permission from you that, that your mom is on the line. Like, you can't discuss bank things. She can't be on the line without you verifying. So then I have to go like, hi, yes, Leslie, I verify and give permission that my mom can be on the line on this call with her my mom literally just chimes in hello haha <laughs> yes i'm i'm here too i'm her mother and then i have to go through this whole extra process with the bank to verify and th that with my that my mom's allowed to like say things and that i'm i have i have the right to stop anything happening at any point yada 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 anyway so then <laughs> and then um i feel so bad because like the people on the line are like you know trying to help me out and my mom's not a great listener and then so she'll like hear things She'll hear the people on the call and she like isn't understanding what they're saying. I perfectly understand what the guy is saying is extremely care, uh, extremely clear. And my mom goes, mm, sir, sir, you're not making sense. And then he, she mouths to me. She's like, he's, he's not good at this. And I was like, no, mom, mom, he is actually, he is, it's, uh, let me explain it to you. And she's like, she's like, ah, oh, no, no, they, he doesn't get it. He doesn't get it. Just hang up. Call it, call it back, call back. We'll try a different guy. And I'm like, no, he's. My mom isn't listening. Like she's not listening to what he's saying. He's saying it so clearly, but the whole time she's like, "No, no, that's not right. That's not right." And I'm getting my blood is boiling. Like my blood is like, "This is me Christmas night, 11:30 p.m. 
just so tired. And then that's, and then they tell me, oh yeah, that was a ticket master charge or whatever. And I'm like, oh yeah, like I, I went to, I bought a bunch of tickets to go see a show in May. And my mom's like, oh, thank you. We hang up. That's the first charge. And then my mom goes, okay, three days later, what is this? $130. Where, where did you go? And I'm like, huh, mom, mom, I'm going to, I'm going, I'm, I'm, so I, I had like, I had a meltdown. I was having, I've been having a meltdown. Okay. I've been losing it. And so, so that's what I've been doing for Christmas. Everyone's like, someone said like on Twitter, like I read a tweet and it was somebody saying, oh, Twitter, I would say, oh, Christmas is the most relaxing day of the entire year. And I thought they were joking. I was like, are you kidding me? Christmas has been the most stressful day. My Christmas was me waking up immediately um, getting ready. And then my entire extended family rolls in at 11 o'clock. I'm getting um, interrogated about certain things. My, uh, it's, it's just like back to back qu to questions, blah, blah, blah. It's kind of like fun because it's like my cousins and I talk to my, co my, my, my little cousins all grown up now. She brought her boyfriend. They're in law, like they're lawyers now. They're not in law school anymore. They're full blown lawyers. And I'm like, wow. So like, what's it like when you guys argue? Um, and she's like, yeah, sometimes it's, when we argue, it's actually funny because we'll get like, we'll start talking and he'll, she'll, she's like, I'll say things like you quote, or, you said, and I quote, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, that sounds miserable. And she's just like, oh no, it's funny. But like in all, like in all seriousness, it's actually not that bad, blah, blah. And I was like, so do you guys watch like how to get away with murder? <laughs> she's like, no. <laughs> I was like, yeah, well, I always wonder, like, do doctors, like, doctor couples, like, sit down and watch Scrubs together? Do they watch Grey's Anatomy? <laughs> uh, anyway, so then that's what I was asking my little cousin. She's not little anymore. It's crazy. She's literally 27. And I'm like, I remember her turning four. So anyways, so um, we, th there's that, right? And then the, my parents, oh, my cousins all leave. Um, so this is Christmas Day. This is yesterday. And then my cousins all leave and then on the way out they're like come over for game night tonight by the way we're gonna play we're gonna play dutch blitz and this game called cabo and i was like okay sounds good my mom's like oh she's not going anywhere until she does her taxes and i was like <laughs> so my aunt's like so are you coming <laughs> i was like i'll be there <laughs> so then they all leave and then i'm like mom before we get into my taxes i have a billion things to give away i have like a bunch of giveaways i'm supposed to announce today and i was like i need two hours and she's like two hours okay fine and then we do it so i was like yeah that's fine so i escape to my my mom's room i close the door and for two hours straight i'm like talking to emily and Ryden, and we're like all right we need to pick 10 giveaways for the winners for this. We need to DM these people. Boom, 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 boom. I'm tweeting this. Does this look good? Did you reach out to this person? All right, sounds good. Uh, did you pick somebody for Twitter? Get Instagram, blah, blah, blah. Uh, did you DM them already? Okay, these people replied. This address is in Mexico. I can't, um, this 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 one, this address isn't like linking up with the Amazon address. Uh, send a message back to them. Tell them they need to give me the right colony, blah, 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 blah. And then I'm like, okay, this Philippines address, the Amazon doesn't ship to them. Okay, we just ship it here first then i have to physically we have to personally mail that one out so we're like keeping tabs of all this stuff and on my head's going to explode but we we do a good job we like uh, emily and ryden are like godsend we start i start messaging people we they start messaging people we got most uh, i would say we're like 50 percent 40 40 percent done we're like we got the winners chosen now is the the shipping and stuff so congrats if you won, by the way. Very, um, very exciting for all of you. Um, we still have Vlogmas winner week four. You can still win stuff. Um, I just finished Vlogmas, the final week of the vlogs. Today, right before stream, you'll see me wearing this. I announced the final prize, which is another trip to Disneyland. So you still can win a trip to Disneyland for you and a plus one. So I'm doing two trips to Disneyland, hotel and flight paid for. Um, and then, um, so that's going to be that. And then all of the Vlogmas winners will be announced in the vlog in Vlogmas week four. I'll put everyone's names are going to be at the bottom, but a lot of you guys already know that you won or week one. Some of you might already have gotten your switch. No, you're not getting into the 28th, but like three of you should be getting your Nintendo switches on the 28th. Two of you, I still need to, um, make sure I have the right address. Um, cause it's in the Philippines and Mexico and stuff. <sighs> okay. Anyways. So then there's that. I went home. 
I went home. Yes. So that was my Christmas. But then I went to my cousin's house and it was very nice. We had hot pot and um, we had hot pot. I got to talk to my cousin a lot. My cousin's like, like my cousins are all doing like super well. It's actually really cool. Uh, they're all like popping off in their own careers. Working in all different things, lawyers, people, um, like, my one of my cousins is, like, CEO of this company, um, that's, like, all, does artificial intelligence and stuff called AnyScale, and he's, like, killing it. And he was telling me all about it, and I'm like, wow, you are insane. And he's like, yeah, one of our clients is, like, Riot Games. And I was like, Riot? That's so cool. <laughs> he's, like, doing so well, um, and so I love it. I mean, he, half the things he says, I'm like, ah, it's going over my head, but... I always knew he was going to be really successful. Um, and then um, my parents go went around showing the clip of me and Ray at the Game Awards to all everyone at my fam. We're sitting there. My mom's like, oh, look, 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 look at Leslie. And then she's like, she shows my cousins. And then she's like, you represented the Asians so well. And I was like, thanks, mom. <laughs> thanks. She's like, you did so good for an Asian. I was like, what are you even saying, mom? What are you for an Asian? I did great. Thanks. Thanks, Bob. <laughs> She's like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> you're, you're representing the Asians. <laughs> I was like, yeah, okay. <laughs> she's proud. She's proud. She's bad with her words. I was like, I get what you're saying. I can tell she's proud because she's showing off. She's like, look at look, that's Leslie. That's Leslie. Look, she's so tall. She's so tall. She's like, there's a lot of short Asians. So she, she looks good tall. She's like tall. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, Bob. <laughs> What are you saying? <laughs> she's on one. Um, so, so that so she's proud of me. She doesn't she doesn't phrase things right, but she is proud of me, and it felt nice. It was a backhanded compliment, um, but I'll take what I can get from my mom. Uh, very sweet of her. Um, and let's see. She um, oh, I, she made some some food for me. Some nice sandwiches. Um, they've just all agreed. Uh, my entire family just have all uh stop trying to get me to help around the kitchen that's just like not a thing they don't have me do anything they just accept that so i found the secret to like my mom like not like talking my ear off constantly i just didn't have to be around her and then i can do my own thing so what i actually did was like i would sit in the kitchen around the f everyone else who was like chopping things and cleaning but i'm on the computer playing tft and i just turned the volume down because if I keep the volume up, my mom goes, ooh, that sounds like monsters. And I was like, yeah, ooh, yeah, it's monsters. And she's like, wait, are you gaming? And I was like, ah! So, so I turn it down. So I just play TFT muted. 